Hey everyone, welcome back to today's vlog. It is Monday. I'm home with a little <laughs> sick chicken nugget. You can hear him in the back kind of coughing. Um, we don't know what he has. He's been coughing all night. It hasn't been any worse than that. He had a slight fever last night, um, but major coughing. Um, and a runny nose. We tested him for COVID, it's not COVID. Um, I have been waking up the last few days with like a pounding headache. So I don't know if we're just getting like a really bad cold right before spring enters. The weather has been going up to like 75 and then drops back down to like 30. So I don't know if it's like our bodies are not okay with this dang weather again. Um, but yeah, uh, we're home today. I'm just trying to get some stuff down. I'm gonna be cleaning. I'm gonna show you guys my first baby haul. I haven't gotten absolutely everything in on the baby haul from Target, like the clothing haul. Are you tired? <sighs> yes uh but i do have a lot of stuff that i could show you guys so i'm just gonna do that and i have a lot more coming in i actually like talked to my mom um over the weekend and i originally was gonna throw like just a barbecue at the house something like, small but somebody is already taking over the baby shower planning um and i had to make a registry so i do have everything from ollie um unfortunately i went down there yesterday just to see like uh if i needed to add anything to my registry um and his swing is broken so it was a swing and bouncer in one the graco um dual x i think it was called um and yeah the wire was all messed up it's not working um one of the bins got really bad water damage and of course it has all of the like <clears throat> It has all of the, <laughs> are you okay? Yes. yes. It has all of, nuggie. yes you are a chicken nuggie. <sighs> it has all of the baby's like cloth items from the bulk items, if that makes sense. Like um, the bouncer's uh, like pad that goes over top of it. Um, so all of it is kind of yellow and I'm hoping that I can get it out because I'm kind of upset about it. The the sit me up the daca tot um the boppy even has it on there the like the play mat has it on there i'm just hoping i can like you know get it out or i don't want to have to replace it because it's stained it's just it looks like baby poop on every single item but it's water damage <laughs> Uh, so I don't want to have to replace anything to be honest. So we might just have to suffer through it and just put blankets down um, But yeah, I need a new swing uh, I didn't really use the swing or the bouncer with Ollie because he didn't like it He was like more of a on me type of baby, but Lily absolutely loved the swing um, which is why I'm saying this because I wouldn't buy it if I didn't know if I needed it or not um so Target does, I have the red card, so Target does like six month, you can return it. So I'm just gonna like buy it towards, you know, um, the end of my pregnancy. And then if I don't like it, I can just return it. Um, or if I just don't need it in general, uh, I can return it. So yeah, I got a lot of items coming in. I bought a big car seat. I got a travel system with like an infant car seat. I got a, um, bedside bassinet um i got nursing tanks and bras because they're on sale this week for 20 25 percent off i think um i got those and then i also got some more clothes and some you know i got komotomo komotomo bottles um coming in because they were on sale through amazon um so I have like a bunch of things coming in, but I made my registry through Amazon and I sent it to my mom. It has like 70 items on there. It's like mostly postpartum stuff. Um, it's public if you would like to see it. It has, it's just under my name. Um, 
instead of just like getting all the bulk items i my mom was like you have to put something on there people are going to be bringing stuff you need to do something um so i just created something with things that i thought i would need especially like postpartum care breastfeeding care um I, I got my pump already actually i bought two pumps i bought the mom cozy and i was able to get the lv through my insurance it wasn't completely free i had to pay about 200 dollars um but it was covered halfway um i know the lv pump is like 400 dollars. it's like close in range with the willow um but i hear good things about it but that's why i wanted to buy two different pumps if i don't like one one was through insurance and then i could always return the mom cozy if i don't like it um so i bought those two and we'll see how it feels um if you're new here i did have to exclusively pump after like two months with oliver he would not latch after the two month mark it was like a huge ordeal he got like rsv and it was just like a hot mess um so i pumped until he was like nine 10 months old and then i had a huge stash of milk and he was able to use that until he was a year old um i had a significant oversupply it was a lot of milk constantly i had to pump like every three dollars on that or i was engorged um so that's why i was trying to go for like the hand free pump so it was just easier i did put like a hand pump on my registry along with like um nursing pads and stuff like that so a bunch of like nursing essentials um target also does a 15 percent off coupon if you're around 32 weeks and you had your register like you did a registry through them i did a lot of the postpartum care that i already put on my amazon onto target as well because if if no one gets it because no one gets it normally i'm like the only person who ever does like breastfeeding or um postpartum care as like baby shower gifts because everybody forgets about it they're always focused on like baby clothes and stuff like that um so i put it on at the target one so if and no one gets me anything for that i'll be able to use the 15 percent off and get my whole postpartum care situation um 15% off so that's nice also a uh, frida baby now or frida mom now how it's like a c-section postpartum kit so um if you're having a c-section you can also buy that uh because they only had the mom like the vaginal birth one when i was had my c-section with this one yes buddy a lot of double game. oh no buddy you gotta hurry up you only got 15 minutes who are you looking at <laughs> Up. No, you hurry up. Well, you hurry up. Say hi. Say hi. Hi, hi Apache Chicken. <coughs> Are you coughing in my face? Hurry, buddy. Okay. We'll see you over. Anyways, just played a game with Ollie. Um. I got a bunch of coughs in my face. Um, I'm gonna head downstairs and get the haul of everything that I bought. Um, it's mostly just clothes and like toys, <laughs> toys at this point. Um, so I can show you guys everything that I got. I did do a little mini haul in one of my last vlogs. So I'm just gonna show you that. And I am finishing up a cleaning video today. Hopefully I can get through it and a couple of TikToks. I have been posting over there again regularly every day so if you would like to check it out as always it's down below um i can like a lot of this stuff that i'm getting through like my amazon storefront um i do make a commission off that stuff um but if you would like to you know buy it it's there so it's like quick links all the clothes are like target and i bought from marshall's so i can't really link it um a lot of it was on sale so Ew, did you just wipe your boogers in your hair? Yes, we have. Okay, so I brought everything up. It's in a huge hamper. I have a lot of clothes to go through. Um, and then I have two bags from Marshalls and Target. So let's just get through this stuff first because it's easier. Um, so I go to Marshalls like randomly. And it used to go a lot because there was one right near my old building at work. But uh, since we moved, 
I haven't been able to go to that one and it was pretty good. Um, but yeah, they have like a lot of discounted stuff. Uh, so if you're looking in, into getting things, you know, cheaper as an option. Um, Target was having a sale. To be honest, all the stores around my area, except for one, had all the little yellow tags on them. Um, the other ones you had to like scan in the store because if you scanned it on the app, it didn't work. Um, but there was like things on like actual sales, so that's what I got. I got vitamin D drops, of course, because I'm breastfeeding. I know I'm gonna need more than this, but this is a start. Um, I got. I've never heard of this brand before and I've never tried it, but I like the fact that it's like um, easy. This is like the whole pack. It is the Good Nest um, bath set for babies. Um, I have to look up to see if it's like got good reviews on Target, um, but it's fragrance free. And you get like pretty much like this inside and a baby bomb moisturizer along with like the reusable bottle and then a three in one baby tablet foam. You get two of them. And then I also got like an extra one. This comes with two of them as well. So I have four all together. That should probably last me a while. Um, I use the Pepet. Pep Petite, I don't know what it's called. It starts with a P and it's like a green bottle on Ollie because it works so well in his eczema um, that that is what I put on my registries. But this was on sale. This was originally like uh, $20, I think, and I got it for like 11. So it was like half off. Um, and then this was also half off. I think these are like $6 and I got it for like three. Um, and then I picked up A&D ointment because a and ointment is, like we use that instead of um, like actual like bum cream. I don't like that. Um, I also don't like the smell of it. A&D ointment doesn't smell that bad. Um, now that we have a dishwasher, I got a dishwasher caddy. This was on sale like a dollar off. It wasn't like a lot, but got that. And then for Marshalls, um, I found this little um, stackable teether set. Um, and it was originally $15 and I got it for $10 there. And then I got this Itsy Ritzy Chewy Crew. It's a little llama. And it's originally $10 and I got it for $5.99. Um, and then I picked up these little wooden monthly photo props. It was originally $10 and I got it for $5.99. And then of course I picked up some um, nursing pads. These were originally $10 and I got them for $5.99. I got two packs. Um, and there are 42, um, 42 of them in each pack. So, perfect. Um, now onto the clothes. It's not just clothes, there's also like blankets and towels and stuff in here. And like I said, I haven't gotten everything in the mail yet. Um, this is just the bulk of it. But I'm gonna show you how big the basket is. Like it's overflowing, full of clothes. Um, so I'm gonna get through this as best as I can, uh, especially because I'm sitting here. I think I'm just gonna put the basket on the floor and like pick up and go. Um, I did get a couple things from Marshalls because they had things on sale. Like I said, it's a pretty good area to go. Um, I found a Swaddle Me sleep sack. This is for three to six months, and it was originally $12, and I got it for $6. Um, so yeah, not too bad. And then I found these Carter Baby three-month um, sleepers. This one's just a safari theme. And it was originally $17, and I got it for $11.99. And then I found this little Disney Yoda set. It's zero to three months. It was originally $12 and I got it for $7.99. So cute. Um, and then I think everything else is from Target. 
I zoom this in a little bit so you can actually see what I'm doing. But the Cloud Island uh, muslin blankets were on sale. They were clearance down 30%, but I got them 50% off. You can play with whatever you want. So um, this is how you could tell with a little clearance sticker. Um, they have like a little 30% at the top, but I actually got it for 50% off. So I just got this, they, this was the only boy one they had. The other ones were like pink flowers. It wasn't even like neutral, nothing like that. So I got this. Blankets are blankets, I really don't care what they look like. Mommy, where's my little car? What little cars? Oh, they're downstairs, bud. They're down the Yeah, and then I also got this um, blanket set. It's from Red Rover. Um, this was, it said 50% off, but I actually got it for 75% off, and this is just like farm animals. Mm -hmm. I had to go downstairs and get Alia's cars because Anthony left them down there. <laughs> um, I got, I've never heard of Lovable Friends, but this is the brand, but I only got these because it's, uh, like guitar themed, and Anthony likes, he plays the guitar and has a little penguin theme, the cartoon guitar. I don't know how much this was on sale, but... This was on sale, and I got it. This was on sale in the actual store. I got it for $3.50. They're just little joggers. If you guys know, I keep everything super easy. Um, I don't like to buy um, items that my kid isn't gonna be comfortable in, especially like jeans and stuff at this age. I just don't think it's worth it to buy that stuff, it's not, especially like sneakers, um, fancy outfits, like I just want my kid to be comfortable and I don't wanna have to keep changing 16 outfits just because I want them to look cute. Like obviously I'll buy certain outfits for pictures, um, but on a day to day basis, this baby will just be in like onesies <laughs> and sleepers. Um, and that's exactly what I did with Ollie, so I'm not gonna change it up now. Um, yes, buddy. Okay. I did buy from newborn to, um, I think three to, not, three to six months. Um, so I got these little woven long sleeve onesies. They came in a set. And like I said, everything was on sale, so it's not going to be like accurate on the tag. They were having a 20% um, off baby items, so um, I can't really tell you how much everything was. Um, I know this came in a set, I just don't know which one. This is three to six months. I got a lot of neutral things, or just like the blue ones. This is also three to six months. I like these ones because they go from the bottom up. I think I talked about the newborn ones already. I think that was the same pack. This all came from the same pack. So a blue one and then this blue striped one. And this one as well. All right, I think that was like the largest pack I got. Um, and then I also found these woven ones. So cute. This is also three to six months because um, I'm hoping by the time that he fits in three to six months, so it'll be like winter time woven or at least a little colder. Um, I did get like washcloths and burp cloths. These were on sale. These are the Muslim ones. Um, I got this little set. Again, everything was on sale, so I really didn't care about like what the patterns look like, especially because boy patterns are the worst because i like i don't care if he ruins these um so it's a little sailboat theme with you know submarines this is three to six months i got this little tie-dye sweatshirt this was six to nine months but this does not look six to nine months because it is cat and jack cat and jack runs disgustingly small <laughs> disgustingly small i already know that is going to be like a huge problem with cat and jack um so that says six to nine, it's probably not gonna be six to nine. Um, this is three to six, just that dark green, zero to three. This is also zero to three. 
This came in a pack, zero to three. So cute. And then I got this six, six to nine months because I thought that was cute. Um, and then this also came in a pack of three. The woven little onesies in neutral colors. This was three to six months. Yeah, a lot of the stuff, like the long sleeve stuff is three to six months because that's when I figured he would be in that size. This is zero to three. Um, and everything I'm picking up is pretty much Cloud Island. This is Cloud Island's um, muslin bibs. Just, you know, normal colors. All right, another pile is ready. I got this little dino set of hooded towels. I don't know what happened to all of Ollie's towels, if I just got rid of them or what, but, so I got this. This is Cloud Island. Um, and then I got this little safari themed um, washcloths. And then just like the, just like the little woven, woven, they have them in the towels too. And I thought this was cute. So got these. And then I got these cute little socks. I really don't buy a lot of socks because I buy everything footed, um, but just in case we need them. Uh, and then I got these in three to six months. I love these. These look so cute. I actually like the blues that they're choosing this time around instead of, and the greens. Oh my God, I'm in love with the greens. Like I'm buying certain packs just for the greens. This is three to six months. So cute. I love them. Um, this is three to six months. How cute. Um, so the baby's supposed to be born in beginning of August. I'm hoping that he comes around that time, three to six months, um, because my mom is going on a cruise and I just don't want to, you know, miss out on my parents meeting the baby. Um, I got this little outfit. This is three to six months too. It's it's thick too. Um, little another sleeper. Like I said, I got a lot of sleepers. Zero to three months, and then this pack is zero to three months too. Like, look how cute the colors are. They're just so nice. I love them. I felt like I had such a hard time finding things for Ollie, especially like in the boys. This is three to six months. Um, because they only had like black and white or like ugly themed ones, if that makes sense. I'm honestly thinking of buying a lot of these packs in like smaller sizes too, because newborn. <laughs> okay, this is my last pile and it's not a lot. I got a two pack of little woven um, joggers. They're so cute. And I got them in size... What size? Zero to three. Ugh, all I needed help in the bathroom. Um, but I think I already showed you guys the newborn stuff. This is the newborn pack. Along with this newborn pack. This is another newborn pack. Mama, mama. What, bud? Why are you doing stuff always up? <laughs> I'm showing everybody all the baby stuff. This is zero to three months, just an adventure pack. Is this Carter's? Nope, still Cloud Island. Another woven pack, zero to three months. These are in, like footless. Um, and then I just got these little sets zero to three months and then this is my favorite one because it's green can you tell them my favorite color is green um so cute and then the last one i got is just a pack of like safari onesies um it's still so in philly it's usually nice until like october november beginning of november and then it starts dropping into like the 40s um so that's why I'm still like zero to three months. This baby's gonna be like still in like this type of clothing. Um, so that's the pack. I forgot this one. I went for a lot of gender neutral stuff. Like I said, I had a hard time finding things. 
um, that wasn't like a bunch of crap on boy items, but they're doing a lot better in the boy section, like I said. This is just very cute items. Uh, but I think I might be buying like more of these types of items, like the woven ones, or just basic ones in different sizes, so then I had them. Um, I do have an order set up with Caden Lane, but it's only like a few items. Um, I got the a blanket with the baby's name on it. I'm still working on that, so I haven't ordered it. Um, a personalized wood announcement thing, and then the baby and I can have a maternity robe and a um, a gown that's matching. They're both green, <laughs> uh, so I figured that's what I would do. Um, to announce the baby's name. We're still working on that. I was hoping that it was gonna be finished by the beginning, like to have our 20 week ultrasound, but me and Anthony are just like using names for like a week and seeing if we like it or not. So I'm sorry guys, like we were so active with Ollie's name. We knew it immediately, but we're having such a difficult time with this baby's name. And to be honest, I don't even care if it has like the IE thing anymore. I just want a name for the baby that fits um i just feel like nothing is just right um and anthony has completely taken the name anthony away because he wants um if we decide to have another baby um a junior he doesn't want the baby to have anthony or my dad's middle name so he doesn't want anthony bryan as the name so he has completely taken anthony away from the pool of names daddy's coming in 30 minutes yeah how do you know that it's the dad's name is Daddy. Oh, his name is Daddy. His name is Anthony Daddy. Anthony <laughs> Daddy. Okay. Um, I'm actually getting hungry, so I'm gonna like quickly eat some fruit and a Gatorade to keep me hydrated. <sighs> and then I, I'm probably just gonna edit because I have like a morning routine that is over two hours long that I have to get through and post for next week. So I'm gonna get to that. Um and cleaning, cleaning is taking over my life. Little baby I'm now filling up my medicine. I got this little container off of Amazon that comes with like individual pills. I used to take a lot more pills there. I took morning and night pills, but now that I'm pregnant, I'm not taking certain pills because they just make me throw up. Um, so I'm on iron pills for the doctor. I take vitamin D, I still take folic acid, I take two of those, and I take a prenatal, and that's pretty much it. Um, I'm going to quickly fill these up, and I'm going to like put out extras for today, because I didn't take my medicine yet. So yeah, just fill them up, and I'm also going to throw some Tylenol in the, the PM ones, just so when I take it to work, I have Tylenol just in case. So Anthony came home, he brought me a burger, and I fell asleep on the dang couch for like two hours. And I'm like editing and doing stuff now, and I'm just realizing this video is gonna be extremely long due to the haul. Um, so I'm just gonna end it here. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, make sure you like this video, subscribe to my channel, leave any questions in the comment section down below. I answer every single comment. And if you guys have any recommendation for baby items that I have missed, just let me know in the comment section. Or you can reach out to me on TikTok, Instagram, whatever you feel. Um, and I'll see you guys in the next vlog. Bye.